my friends. Um, today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to do a pick a card. I keep saying I want to do it, so I'm going to. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take three of our fully charged super moon stones. And I'm going to give you three different options for each pile. And then we'll kind of dive into each of those um, meanings. I have sage. It's all about the sage, my friends. You have to cleanse. I'm gonna keep our jade to the side because it's the right thing to do. Okay, here we go, yo. I have a clear crystal and I have a beautiful jade, but those are just our power kind of stones, so. I love, these are so supercharged. Overnight in the moon, full moonlight, we have our rose crystal. We have our citrine that is like the most amazing stone I've ever seen. It's citrine with like this crystal quartz, amazing beautifulness. And then we have a, um, I think it's a smoke, or it's not a smoky quartz, it's a, oh, what is this? Anyways, it is a quartz crystal. And we're gonna use that as option one, two, or three. So one, two, three. Are you ready? I wish you could see my beautiful setup. It's decent, but I'm working on it. This is what my setup is called for, so this is what I shall do. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nice. Okay. If you chose option one, ooh, we have the tower. We have a happy family. And then we also have the three of wands. With the tower coming out first, it means that there may have been some chaos that occurred in your life. Not to fear, there is death and devastation to a certain extent. However, it's more of a call of regeneration. As you regenerate, you get to this beautiful, beautiful completion, beginning of a very beautiful, happy family. And at that point, you'll be at the Three of Wands, which will allow you the time and the energy and the strength and the beauty to ponder and really reflect upon all the beautiful things that you've earned and worked so hard for. That was option one. Option number two, beautiful citrine. You've received the world card. After that, you did receive the Knight of Swords. And after that is the Two of Wands. The world is pretty much your oyster. The Knight of Swords could be some kind of a message, little abrupt. And the Two of Wands is that message that you received looking at the world. Do you see how you received the world? And this man is holding a world. It's in your hands. The answer is right within your hands. And we have beautiful rose crystal quartz. We start with the queen of pentacles, which is usually finance related or money related and reflecting over everything that has been maybe gained or lost. After this, we have a judgment. We have the judgment card. And then the third card is what I call the action card. It is two, four, six, seven of wands, an action. Something is required to take action on in order for you
to receive that Queen of Pentacles. Thank you for taking the time. I hope you enjoy my reading. It's my first pick a card. Let me know what you think.